Joining us this morning is Misty Valenta with the Williamson County Regional Animal Shelter. And yes. this is little Cashmere. Little Cashmere. She, her name is Cashmere, <laughs> mm -hmm. but she is so soft. You could like almost like a cashmere sweater. Absolutely, and her personality too. She is one of the sweetest cats we have for adoption right now. Um, she's just remarkable. She's four years old. She's lived in a foster home, so we know she's good with adults, with children, even babies um, and other cats. Her go-to thing is this. She is an ultimate lap cat. You're yeah. not kidding about that because she's been sitting over here. I've been looking at her and she's just so quiet and she's so quiet. She's got the cutest little muse. She is a Siamese, so she can get talkative sometimes, but with her cute voice, you don't mind it. Yeah, and she obviously really likes being petted here too. Yes. So what exactly is her story and how did she end up um, in your care? So she's been in and out of our shelter, unfortunately, a few times. She came to us first as a stray with a broken leg. Um, we helped get her all healed and ready for her home and she got adopted and then brought back a couple of times, no fault of her own, just family circumstances. So now we've decided it's time for her true home. Let's get her a home where she can last. And so obviously we have New Year's Eve coming up and right. we've been talking about fireworks this morning. Um, is there anything that people can do at home to maybe present, uh, or I'm sorry, prevent any mm -hmm. strays coming in to the Absolutely, because uh, she's an example. When you're a stray out there, you can get hurt, and that's obviously what we don't want to happen. So keeping your pet safe during um, any time that fireworks are going off is a way to keep them healthy and keep the animals at the shelter healthy, too, because we're not having to be overcrowded with strays. So um, if you're having a lot of people go in and out of the house, uh, keep your animals in a space where they can't slip between someone's legs, uh, rushing out keep some music on or the TV, uh, give them something to do. So if they're a chewer or they like scratching, give them an activity. Um, you can even use um, some lavender scent to help calm them down. Um, there's a whole range of things that you can do to help them feel safe and secure. And if you have a high anxiety animal, you can always talk to your vet about some um, medica medications you can use. She still is so calm. I think maybe TV is making her a little bit nervous. Uh, this is the most I've seen her move, but she's really very sweet. Yes, she's absolutely, like I said, one of the sweetest cats that we have. And she's so sweet. She um, is part of our off-site uh, adoption program. So she's actually at the PetSmart in Georgetown at Wolf Ranch. Um, so if you would like to meet her, um, she'll be over there when the store opens. Awesome. So if you are interested in Cashmere, you can go by the Williamson County Regional Animal Shelter. Their information is right up there on your screen right now. And Cashmere will hopefully not be leaving too soon. She's too sweet to leave the studio <laughs> just yet. And you can check out other cats and dogs looking for a good home by logging on to the pet section of KVU.com. Thank you, Misty and Cashmere, for being here this morning. And now let's get a check at your forecast with Chief Meteorologist Albert Ramon. Bryce, you better go atop Cashmere. I'm going to race you to that Georgetown Pet Smart. That's a sweet cat. All right.